What I enjoy most about K education is um, the information that I share with them, um, the, 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 the support groups that we do, um, and just engaging with young people, understanding them, understanding their views, and um, considering their health and rights first. So that's what I enjoy most about, about uh, being a PhD teacher. Enjoy engaging with young people, peers, uh, peers that are my age, adolescents, the children, they are so fun. It's really nice to be involved in young people. You get to know a lot from each other, you get to learn a lot from each other. So I really love everything that goes ahead with being a peer supporter. My role as a BA supporter is to help adolescents and young people living with HIV to build confidence in their lives towards within their goals and become self-determined by having a healthy life that is free from mental disturbances and viral blood supplies. Nous faisons la permanence en hôpital, nous accueillons les médecins dans la structure. C'est euh, la sensibilisation, sensibilisation dans des écoles, en cours de route, euh, dans des hôpitaux, plus, plus précisément euh, les jeunes, les adolescents de 10 à 24 ans. Étant père éducateur, mon rôle et euh, d'aider nos pères dans la communauté euh, qui puissent adapter un, un comportement sain et responsable et en leur produisant des conseils sur euh, l'observance et, et l'adhérence au traitement antirétroviraux. I find it challenging about being a peer educator mostly um, is uh, on, on reaching out to those out to reach areas like um, the peri urban areas we have the United Rural Hospitals. We have uh, peers or patients who come from uh, those hard to reach areas and it becomes difficult for us to do you know, home visits. It becomes difficult for us to, to reach out to them whenever we need them. Like, you realize there's a lot of challenges, economic strength and challenges. We have uh, challenges with, with reaching out to them. They don't have phones that are always working, you know, so that has been the most challenging. What are the challenges I actually have at the level of the center is where adolescents who come to pick up medication at their rendezvous given to them and go back home and at the end of the day you realize they don't have a good virus operation. Maybe perhaps they don't have a very good caregiver or they are not living with their biological parents who can actually follow them up to make sure this medication is being administered. Secondly, we know we live in the atmosphere here in the Cameroon, especially in the northern and southwest where there is ongoing crisis. We have young girls who are pregnant and maybe perhaps one or two circumstances they are not able to have access to medication on time. This part of program has helped me very much to improve on my day-to-day -day activities. It has really helped me build my confidence and also build hope to adolescents who still have stigma, encourage them, and also they know, get to know their rights as the young people and adolescents living with HIV. For me, the most thing that I enjoy being, uh, being a peer supporter with is engaging with other young people uh, from, from all over the, the Southern African uh, countries. You know, get to understand how other young people are doing it, how uh, their experiences in terms of uh, service delivery, in terms of um, information sharing, in, to, in terms of the latest things that are happening. Uh, and also, it creates an exposure for, for us to, for me personally, to you know, like um, engage with other organizations besides, uh, besides you know, Zandiri, besides um, uh, FSD, besides Pata, you know, get to engage with other young people in the world of them. 
coming to the Pata. Pata's supported me, helped me through building confidence because sometimes back I had stigma, I was stigmatized. Now I build confidence in me so as to disclose to my fellow. Yeah. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you. You can fly a sparrow wings like a sparrow. Ooh. When they wanna put you down, but you become victorious. Ooh. When you can own land just like I'm a poodle.